Uh, it was a good meet today. Um, we're swimming pretty tired right now. Most of our kids were entering probably our fourth week of doubling every day. So, you know, they're, they're a pretty tired bunch, and I, I thought they swam, you know, really well today, all things considered. Yeah, we had uh, three more people qualify for our conference meet today. We had Adam qualify in his 100 breaststroke. We had Lindsay qualify in our 100 backstroke. And I'd probably say the swim of the day was Brian uh, in his 500 free where he dropped 18 seconds from the week before to qualify for the conference meet. Oh, it, it brings a lot of excitement. Uh, we still have one more girl, Megan, to qualify. Um, I'm confident she's going to do it next week, but it just gives the team a jolt saying, okay, they only rested a couple days for this meet. You know, what's going to happen when we rest for two and a half weeks for the conference meet? So, again, it does definitely bring life, breathe life into the kids knowing we have one more full week of, of hard work and then we start to taper. Yeah, Zach's been great. Um, it's, it's kind of like a running joke for us because his freshman year, he was interviewed on TV and he, he told him on TV he wasn't sure if he was going to swim his sophomore year. Um, and here we are three years later. Um, he was a great leader for us. Um, you know, he's a very positive individual and really hard worker. And he kind of, anyone that joined the team, he embraced them and kind of brought them under, you know, his wing. So he's been a really good leader uh, and he's going to be sorely missed next year for sure.